Hello folks. Come in the woods there today now to cut a, a load of wood for the splits. Spray all the load there. Sawn off it. Two dry ram pipes in it. Yeah, enough splits for the winter there now. Yeah. We got a cut over here now that uh, Igor, back five, six years ago, we had a storm here and blew down most of this hill there. See a lot of logs over there lid down. And this here was all one big pair of forks of logs. And well, a lot of people got it all cleaned up, most of it. Lots of dry wood up there. Look. I'd have more, but it's like 11 miles from home. Not much dry wood at home, so I uh, come in and get a load. Go on to there now, about early the summer. Use one, but it's working pretty good. Young fella's bike. See what she like now the one's all the moose, I guess. We get some. She'll get and I seen one coming up this morning, put out the camera and uh, gone in a flash. Yeah. Uh, just doing a little video, never done a video in a long time there now and just touching base. Hope everybody had a good summer. And the fall's on the way. One degrees there last night. Yeah, got all me, uh, all me snares done, most of me traps. I gotta work 12 o'clock today, so get uh, get them rest done night now and packaged up. Then I'm gonna start putting out my boxes, mink boxes. I don't know, I got 45 or 50 to put out somewhere. Down around shore or something like that. In a few brooks there, I've seen a few minks around the year, so hopefully get a few. Not much price on them, no, I had oxen there the other day. Lord, wicked. Getting about 20 25 dollars for them. So six, I believe it was. Yeah. Yeah, one of my otters there went for, for 73. That was a pretty good price. Yeah, anyhow guys, I'm going to sign off there now and haul on this load of wood and put that in the basement and clave it up for splits and when I touch nothing else the winter, I just grab it and go. Alright, sign off. Take care and have a, have a nice fall.